So we recently started pushing our devs to find a day on their schedule where they might have some free time in between projects, pick a subject matter, whether it's something having to do with the code base that they use, or if it's a new code, or if it's a new third party app or something that they can, you know, train, learn, maybe get an online class for or something, nothing ridiculous, like a master class from Gordon Ramsay, but you know, something related to, to what they do and what they want to learn about. So they could take the day and kind of feed, nurture that, that hunger, that drive to learn. That seems to have really taken off. It seemed to be really uh, well received by our devs and they were looking forward to it and all trying to schedule basically the same day. We came up with the idea of a training day because it's important to keep growing and improving yourself. And most people don't take the time. Here's what's funny about it. Everyone was excited about it and no one signed up. So here's the thing that we learned, and, and this has been true on several things. When we did our uh, retirement stuff, when we did the um, this training thing, all of the little perks and things that we do, everyone loves them, but there's no follow through. If you really want to show your employees that you want them to grow, you're gonna, you have to do it. And so Jen, my wife who does HR, um, she is calling them every month to make sure that they schedule a training day and that they get it, get their training approved because they won't do it otherwise. And, the, and I get it. They're busy. Oh no. I was going to say, it's not like they don't want to. Yeah. They just, they're busy. They, it's not like, yeah, they, they love the idea. Of it it might just slip their head. They just, they, they, Oh, Oh, I, I forgot. Sorry. 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 So we have to, and that, that follow through is what really separates a good perk from a bad perk. When you're running, when you're running your business, you've got to make sure that you have someone in my case it's my lovely wife who everyone loves. So she is the one that calls them, not calls them. She emails them uh, every month and says, Hey, what are you going to do for training this month? And then the process is they go and find something. We get it approved by me or another dev. And uh, then they go forth and have a day and we pay for the training. That's how it works. I, I would say as a business owner, Make sure you follow up on that. The other thing we started doing was weekly check-ins um, where I send emails out to all of our team um, to just see how they're doing. And the response to that has been pretty amazing. Now, I will totally tell you that I stole that from Reed. He's also my marketing guy. Um, he, Says his lovely wife sends, she was sending out emails to their staff and I've read one and I was like, this is amazing. So I totally stole it from them. And I think everyone should steal it from, from her as well. Um, just, just checking quick in little mental health check-ins that yep. probably go a long way. Even if there's no response, just to see that you care enough to check is probably at least a good, a good little yeah, I'd say positive direction there. Half the people respond. They'll reply because they all, they're full of little questions, right? How are you doing? How's your stress levels? That kind of thing. And especially now, I think mental health, it, you know, we're talking about the economy and we don't want to be, have a depressing podcast here, but it's not great, right? And it's going to get worse, um, especially if you're a crypto guy. Um, <laughs> but there's worse. Stress is real. If you're burnt out, you're working too many hours and your boss is oblivious to it. Yeah. You're going to leave. You're just going to leave. If anybody had any questions or comments or wanted to get in touch with us in any way, hello at thebigpixel.net. That's hello at thebigpixel.net. Also, you can check this out on YouTube and leave a comment there.